Hey YouTubers, 95 Speed GTA. Today, I'm going to do a fish tank video, which I haven't done in, God, probably 2010. <laughs> but anyway, this is my 55-gallon tank. If you guys remember, I used to have a hexagon 40-gallon tank for a 45-gallon tank. And I don't have that anymore. I actually traded it for a car amplifier and uh, two 12-inch sub subwoofers from my neighbor. Um, I just got over being really sick, so if my voice sounds different from all my other videos, well, that's why. But anyway, here's my tank. It's a half sand and half gravel setup. Um, I still have the tree stump from like almost two years ago. The big guy loves the tree stump. He likes to hide behind it and rest. Hey, stop that. This is my Oscar fish, Iris. Look how big she got. Uh, she's about uh, she's about nine inches now. I wish I had, oh wait, I do have measurement tape. I'll put it up to her. Uh, Iris, hello baby. All right, she's about she's about seven or eight inches now. And when I got her, she was like the size of a quarter. <laughs> but uh. And, and actually, in another couple of days, she's going to be a year old, because I got her December of last year. I just don't remember when exactly. This is a full-grown albino Oscar fish. And he is huge, and all he likes to do is eat and skim the surface for food. This is a sump fish, and he's about... Turn your side, buddy. He's about five inches now. He actually grew a lot, and he got really fat. Um, I uh, I actually got him when I went fishing uh, over the summertime. I didn't catch him. Um, ex albino banana did, and we put him in my uh, we put him in my tank. And I've been feeding him pellets ever since, and he just got big. And I don't know, but I I'm, I bet he's pretty happy being in the tank because right now where we caught him. He'd be in really cold water right now. There's the BT bloatfish. This is a blood parrot fish. He was one of my first fish that I bought, and uh, believe it or not, he was actually all a. Um, he was actually he wasn't a solid color, but he was a uh, like a dark, like a like a dark gray with black stripes. I don't know. I'm pretty. I'm pretty sure maybe he was dyed, because as he was growing. Uh, his colors were, f were flaking off. But when I got the uh, the tree stump, that's when I noticed a change in him. And I don't know if he changed to blend in with the tree stump. Because if you look at the stump and you look at him, <laughs> it's stupid. <laughs> when you look at him and the tree stump, they look very similar. So I don't know. Uh, finally, uh, I have a... This is a Grammy. And I had twins. And uh, if you look back at my old old videos, that's when um, that's when I had um, albino bananas, uh, tiger Oscar fish, and he brought uh, he brought two of those Grammys too. So they were they were left when Cleopatra, the Oscar fish, went to her new home. Um, my last fish that's in there is a uh, convict cichlid, and uh, I think it's a girl. I don't remember, but. Um, there he is, he's out, he or she is out, and, uh, he or she got a little bigger too, I can't feed him the big pellets, but I feed him like the, the, the flakes and smaller pellets, um, this guy, this guy, and this guy, and this guy tries to, but it doesn't work. Those three, they eat the big pellets, and the rest, they eat the medium to small pellets. Um, I plan on getting a new tank because my 55-gallon is going to get too crowded once Iris gets a little bit bigger. And you can't really have two Oscars in 155. So I'm looking into a new tank. I'm not going to build it because I don't really trust it. Because, you know, 55 gallons of water is a lot, and if I get like a 55-gallon plus... Like, I'll probably get, like, a one... I was actually looking at 120-gallon tanks, and it's got to fit in, in this area because this is... Oh, sorry, guys. I scared them. This is, like, my little area. 
that's my uh, my thinking couch. And like I'm doing projects and stuff like that. A place for my laptop to sit on, which I don't have right now. And um, this is like uh, this is like my little corner here. I got a. I was gonna get like a new uh, what do you call it? A new top, but. If I'm going to get a new tank, then there's no point. But that's my cat's second hole. And um, that's where she hangs out when I'm sitting on here thinking or just, you know, watching TV or something like that. Um, and that's my other TV with the Xbox and stuff. But uh, from, like, any angle in my room, I could sit and look at them. But this is my favorite spot to do that. So the fish tank has to fit here in this spot. And I don't want it to be too big and cluttered so uh that's it this is my fish tank those are my fish and um the only thing that i'm probably gonna do before i get a new tank is i want to get a crayfish again but this guy don't like crayfish he doesn't eat them he actually kicks them out of the tank um i had a blue crayfish that i put in the tank like a couple days later he kicked them out and i don't know where he went and then i found him like a week later in between my bed so that's why I got that up there. I don't want that to happen again. But what I do plan on doing is I wanted to get a pipe and cut it in half so it's like a U and run the pipe under the sand and the gravel underneath the tree stump so he has a place to hang out and go. And you know, the little fish can go in there too, but the big fish won't harm him. Oh, I forgot one thing. <laughs> I'm gonna feed them now. <laughs> They're so hungry. They, they act like I don't feed them at all, but I do. They're hungry. Alright, I gotta put this down for a sec. Alright, usually what I do is, uh, well, I throw this in and slam the door as fast as I can because it's kind of a race between two Oscars to see who gets the most pellets, and I usually get soaked. And I mean soaked, because water will come splashing out of there. But... Since I'm showing you, here we go. Whoa! <laughs> See what I mean? Oh, looks like the Omega Fish wins today. Come on, Iris, get some food. Omega Fish. You're one ugly fucking fish. <laughs> Here we go again. All right, Iris, ready? Grab it. Grab it, grab it, grab it before he comes. She's getting them. Uh-oh. <laughs> it gets even worse. Like, usually I'll feed them once a day or once every other day. But, like, uh, when I feed them once every other day, that's when they get really violent. Not like they fight each other, it's just... The splashes of the water are more intense, but that's their feeding. <laughs>